Hello, I'm here to try to show you all of the animals from this Animal Jam crystal reef thing. Unfortunately, I cannot find this animal for the life of me, so I'm just going to leave it out. So, terribly sorry about that. Okay, so to start, one of the first things you're going to want to find is the clownfish. The clownfish is up here. So what you have to do is you have to click on this coral and the clownfish will then come out Then just give it a little tap. Sometimes I think it comes out on its own, but I think your best bet is to click on the coral. Next thing we're going to look at is these little acorn barnacle things. Acorn barnacle. Well, it's just sort of situated on this little rock here. So I guess it's kind of hard to just show you, but that's where it is. The next thing I'm going to show you is this, the Feather Duster Worm. The Feather Duster Worm, a lot of you might have noticed it already. It kind of goes in and out all the time, like that. Even if it's down, you can still click on it just at the bottom here and it still counts. So, oh, while, while it's here, this is the whale. It'll just come past here every now and then. You give that a little click and then that's your whale. I think that's what it's called. Yeah, humpback whale. Same with this marlin, um, I thought it was a sawfish, but it just slides past here most often, sometimes after the whale, but if I see it, I'll just um, go over there. Now another bit of coral you want to find is the brain coral. I'm pretty sure you can click on any of these types of brain coral and it pretty much will show up for you. Same with the tube sponge, there's a lot of tube sponges around, I think these. I think I clicked on that or maybe these I'm not sure if you just go around and click on most of them you're sure to come up with something the next thing I'm going to talk about is the puffer fish the puffer fish usually comes around here don't be mistaken when it's not puffed up it still counts as the puffer fish of course it's a lot more easily recognizable when it's big and spiky so that should just come past and then you should be able to click on that so just make sure you just there's a swordfish Sorry, you couldn't really see it very well. It's not a swordfish either. It's a marlin. Totally sorry about that. But that's just, um, you just give that a click when it comes on past. It'll come past a few times if you just stay standing. Now, this one took me a while. The staghorn coral. Basically, the staghorn coral. I'm pretty sure it's this stuff. There's the marlin. Just give that a little click. I'm pretty sure it's just this. You can go around and give all of these a little click. There's plenty of them. Eventually, I'm sure, so you have one here, one here, one here, and while we're over here, let's take a look at this. I think it's a lobster. Fairly obvious a lobster. It's just kind of there and pretty hard to miss. So the other one I'm going to talk about is the stingray. Now the stingray usually floats past here every now and then. It's a lot more common than the humpback whale or the marlin for me. But it seems to be hiding, but eventually you just need to stay for a while and eventually it should come past and you'll be able to get that click. There it is, Stingray. So you just get that little click and then that adds to your journey book. I'm pretty sure we've covered everything except for this one. I'm terribly sorry, I do not know what it is. Um, if anyone knows what it is, could you just give me a um, leave a comment below and Thank you so much. I hope you've, I hope you've been able to, um, I hope you've been able to sort of find a lot of them. I'm really sorry. I couldn't. I don't know where the other one is. Couldn't quite figure it out. Um, please tune into my other videos if you want to see some of where the other animals are. You can win quite cool prizes from that. But yeah, bye, jammers. I'm out.